we're starting to get a clearer understanding of what exactly Death Stranding is and what its title means. Speaking with IGN about the game, Hideo Kojima himself said, I want people to realize that when they die in the game, that isn't the end. As such, there is no game over in Death Stranding. Instead, you'll find Sam in a purgatory place where your view will switch to a first person perspective. And when you find your way back to the world, things won't revert back to how they were before you died. What you did matters. Now spoilers, the Uncharted franchise, pretty darn popular. But we just found out exactly how popular. Lifetime sales for the series now stand at 41.7 million units. Sony made the milestone announcement at the 10th anniversary panel for Uncharted over the weekend. Now I wonder how much that number will grow over the next decade, presumably without Nathan Drake. What do Stranger Things, Get Out, Dunkirk, and The Disaster Artist all have in common? Well, I guess to start, they're all really good, but they're also all up for a Golden Globe. The nominations were revealed today. Dunkirk is up for Best Drama Motion Picture, while The Disaster Artist and Get Out are nominated for Best Musical or Comedy. Meanwhile, Stranger Things is going up against Game of Thrones for Best Drama Series. Oh, and I thought you all would like to know that The Boss Baby, I repeat, The Boss Baby got a nomination for Best Animated Film. And that's your daily fix for December 11th. Now that you're caught up on the news, check out five awesome PlayStation VR games from PSX with this video. Star Child has my attention since it's apparently similar to Super Metroid. And with that, I'm Damon Hatfield. Don't forget to download the IGN app. And remember, you can get your fix anytime online at IGN.